why aren't you taking in any Palestinians? Why is Egypt not taking ah, Palestinians? Why does the Arab world want to constantly attack Israel without actually offering any place to go for the Palestinians? And what do you say to that? That is exactly what Israel wants. And that is exactly what might actually starts Third World Three. This is the war solution. These are Palestinians, these are their land. Mm. And then suddenly take them, why? So they've been basically kicked around from their homes. And now another country should take them? You see what will happen? Imagine this, mm. now. And because Israeli official has been talking openly about this. Mm. It's like, why don't they just go in Sinai? Why they go? Mm. You know what would happen? Those people are gonna be pushed in Sinai. And with any population, two million people, they are living in refugee camp. What do you think will happen? Unrest. Mm. Uh, uh, chaos mm. and then after a few years the Western media will come with their cameras like oh look at those Arabs oh they're killing each other oh Israel is good that they got rid of them mm. and then they will go to the West Bank and suddenly those 3.5 million people push into Jordan this the whole idea why does Jordan take them why does Egypt take them the same question you, Europe has 44 countries why don't they take Israel America has 50 states. Why don't they give them Florida? I mean, they, we seem to complain about Florida the whole time. Why don't they just like give uh, Israel? The whole idea was like, oh, you're Arabs, you're all the same. No, no, no. Because what would happen then? So Israel will move into Jordan? It's like, oh, Saudi, why don't you take the Jordanian? So let me, the, 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 this is not I a hear, solution. I hear, this is I, not a solution. Basim, I, I hear you. I'm not taking a position yeah. either way. Let me ask you directly. But I want to say something about what Queen Radia said. Okay. The whole idea about like the West. Yeah. I think that in three weeks, Israel morally corrupted the West like no other. I think the West will have a lot of time to recover because for years, the West has been telling us, oh, look, we're liberal. We're all about human rights. All are equal. Adopt our values. And then suddenly, well, you, you don't want to even to see, we don't want to even tell Israel to stop. And suddenly we wake up and we found McDonald's are giving free meals to the Israeli, because like nothing will make you feel better after killing a bunch of okay. Palestinian okay. kids than a happy meal.